making that food. And then we need to do one kilo of We're having a competition to see whose bread is no, most efficient, like, the lightest, and can hold the most weight. I was gonna think you might have already got on the food on this one. I know. A suspension bridge is a bridge with cables and main pillars. And so how it works is that the load would be go into around the middle the middle of the bridge and then it would be distributed to the pillars and all the way to the land. This kind of bridge takes a lot of labor, but it can span the longest distances. By building bridges today, I learned that um, it's not as easy as it looks. The hard parts of building a bridge are just um, trying to get it to stabilize. This is called the keystone right here. It's very important. And if you didn't have a keystone, the whole thing would fall down. These joints are here. So they kind of like spread apart as and more flex. weight. Yeah, they, yeah. they yeah, flex, exactly. So. It's going good. We're almost done with the second support. And then we just have to make one more and we'll test out our bridge. So this one is the support beams that to give the bridge more stability. These are the pillars that hold up the roadway. Well, I think our bridge is going to be pretty sturdy because it doesn't feel very heavy. And it's kind of, it's not very, I mean, we've tried squishing these things and they don't squish. It's already. Let's see. It's already bending. I know. Snap, please. We didn't put yeah, any sort of leaning. Yeah, so sort of leaning. So we should have like put like beams in the center connecting yeah. it. So, when, so it would have been because it was leaning like this. Though. It's like it's like you talk about this, but it's like the hands-on thing makes it much more interesting, and it, 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 you really understand the concept better once you actually like do something 